Welcome to my channel, Living Linux. Today I'm going to show you how I installed PPSSPP on my Phytium Octa-Core ARM computer. So I'm running Ubuntu 22.04 at the moment. And someone said it's real easy to install PPSSPP through FlatHub or Flatpak. So here are the instructions to install Flatpak. So just this command. Um, I will also leave a link to this website with the instructions. Um, yeah, when you're running a recent version of Ubuntu, then you can skip these steps. That's no longer needed. And you can install the software Flatpak plugin, but they say it results in two software apps being installed at the same time. So that might be a little bit confusing. So I skipped that part and you have to add the FlatHub repository and then restart your computer. So I already did that. And when I do the commands now, then I get the notification that it's already installed and that it doesn't need to do anything. So uh, when you do this the first time, then just follow the instructions to install it. That's probably just a matter of uh, choosing yes to install. Um, you can find PP as SPP on FlatHub. And then here's the command to install it. You can start it from the command line uh, or at least here with Ubuntu, then it will on also install uh, the icon to start it. So we're doing, going to do a quick test with um, Monster Hunter Freedom and God of War. Uh, I already did some testing and the strange thing is is that I can only choose OpenGL. Uh, I was expecting that I would also be able to choose Vulkan. And since I had some good results with Ether SX2 where I was able to play Final Fantasy X with three times upscaling, I was assuming that PlayStation Portable emulation would be no problem at all, but um, it seems that when you install from FlatHub and then perhaps it's just uh, for my Phytium, but the performance um, is nowhere near what I expected. So we have the rendering resolution just on the original resolution of the PSP. So we're going to test Monster Hunter Freedom.
so this still looks okay but it's just the original resolution and yeah when you can do upscaling then it will look better so just running around in the village then you can see that it's this this is okay so but when you want to play god of war then that's really a problem And with God of War, it really helps to have Hulk Falcon. And you can already hear from the sound that it's having severe performance issues. Suffering for years, Kratos, the once brave general, now known as the ghost of Sparta, has pledged himself champion of the gods of Olympus. In return, he hopes only to rid himself of the nightmares that haunted him for far too long. But for now, his only respite, his only relief from the sins of his past, is found in the Demon Dagger. And on this day, has been called upon by the gods to confront an unthinkable evil unleashed on the city of Attica by the invading Persian army. So now you can also see the notification that it's running slow, it's better to use frame skip. So this isn't really playable. So I'm not really sure if there is something with the flat hub version that my Phytium octa-core ARM computer doesn't really like. Um, so after this I will try to compile it myself and see if I get better results. Um, really expecting better results than this so that's all for now and when you're lazy then you can play simple PlayStation games um, installing it from Flatpak and perhaps on other machines uh, the results are better but in my next video, I hope I will get better results after compiling it myself. So I hope to see you again in my next video.